Today I'm dressing up as Pocahontas. So I'm going to start out with the It Cosmetics CC Cream. It's my favorite. I'm going to put some on one pump on my foundation brush and put it on where I need the most coverage. A thinnish layer. Putting another half pump. I just blended that in a little bit more with my sponge. That was in the shade light. I'm going to take my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation in 112 and just put that where I want to highlight. I'm going to take my Cody Airspun Translucent Powder. I'm going to powder a lot. That puff of smoke and making sure each section has not creased yet. Now that I'm sufficiently powdered, I'm going to take my Morphe 35M palette and go in with this brush and I'm gonna take this color, uh, two neutral brown colors, one's darker than the other. We're gonna contour because she's got some bomb.com cheekbones. And of course, don't forget Sifrit. Take an actual bronzer and a big fan brush. And warm up the contour a little bit with broader strokes, kind of blending it in a little bit. I'm gonna take my powder brush. A little bit of translucent powder and blend that. Moving on to eyes, I'm going to take this peach and this pink and mix them together and fluff that on the eye. And then, just dusting that off, I'm going to take the lightest white color in this palette and go the rest of the way up, making sure to blend the lines. Starting on the eyes, I'm going to take the same palette and a small smudging brush with the darkest black. So now I'm going to take Jordana's 12 hour made to last black eyeliner and go in the waterline. It's a little bit further out than I wanted it, but we'll work with it. I'm going to darken it up with some Jordana 12 Hour Made to Last and the Fabuliner, and I'll be right back. Okay, so now that I've darkened everything up, I'm going to go in 
to the white eyeshadow again and just kind of clean up around here just for a little bit of perfect a little bit of perfection next pocahontas has a bit of a reddish hue to her eyebrows i'm not going to do anything crazy just take a little bit of a medium reddish toned eyeshadow and fill my eyebrows in just a slight tiny bit and then i'm going to put on my essence make me brow my video got cut off, but I just added a little bit more contour, blended it out just to match the intensity of the eyes. Uh, the mascara I pulled to outwards to um, continue the elongation of the eyes. Now we're going to go to lips. I'm going to start out with the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit in Rose. Rebel Rose. And then I'm going to also add the L'Oreal Infallible Lip Gloss in Bare Attraction. Put that on. I went over my Cupid's bow because she doesn't have one. She just has a rounded lip. So I did that and I'm really liking the color. Alright, that's it for today's look. So thank you for watching.